everyone. Today we're going to talk about an issue that everyone kind of has found it to be important at some point or the other at the point of buying an air purifier. At the time of buying an air purifier, you always come across a term called CADR or clean air delivery rate. And most air purifier companies will try and tell you how high their CADR is and entice you to buying their air purifier. Now, there are a couple of things that I want you to understand about CADR. The clean air delivery rate is essentially at what speed or at what rate or what amount of air is the air purifier cleaning per minute or per second. So if it is cleaning a certain amount of volume of air per minute or per hour or per second, I'll get to know in how much time it is going to clean the entire air of a room because I can very easily calculate the volume of air in the room. And typically you want the entire volume of air in the room to be cleaned at least three to four times, ideally four to six times, but a minimum of three to four times per hour, you should be able to clean the entire volume of air in your room with your air purifier. Now, a couple of other things that you have to be very careful of when looking at the CADR number, especially with a lot of the companies that advertise the big CADR numbers saying 600, 800, 1000 plus CADR. That is very important because they are giving you a number which is based on running the machine on highest speed at all times. Now, please remember, the moment you run your machine on high speed, it's going to be very noisy and you're not going to like that and you're going to say, let's put it on a lower speed. So very quickly, you'll put your machine on a lower speed which will not give you that CADR and will not clean the volume of air in the room as many times as you want. And you're not going to get the efficiency that you want from an air cleaning perspective. So my rule of thumb for some of the regular commercial machines available on the market, cut out that CADR by 50%. So if they tell you it's for a room size of 800 square feet, I say no more than 400 square feet. If the company advertises and says, 600 square feet, I say no more than 300 square feet because then you can run the machine on medium mode and still get some sort of efficiency from your air purifier because noise is also important as much as a clean air delivery rate. So ideally you want a machine that advertises its clean air delivery rate at every speed. So you know that at speed one, what is the noise and what is the CADR? On speed two, what is the noise and what is the CADR? And you can then take an informed choice as to what you want out of that machine at what time. Yes, you can leave it on high speed for an hour before you enter the room so it cleans it up and then when you go and put it on medium speed so the noise comes down. But those are things that you can choose to do but that only you can do if you know what's going on at the time of buying the machine. Hope this has been helpful, hope it's been valuable and stay tuned for more videos like this on our social media platforms. Please do invite your friends to join and please, we love to hear from you, your comments, your feedback, especially your questions, because that's what keeps us going on a week to week basis. And we love to give feedback and to help educate everyone about the issues of air pollution. Again, thank you for watching and breathe easy.